Ding, 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 goes the alarm. It's time to wake up and stretch my arms. Play, 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 play and it's fun. It's time to learn. Come on, everyone. It's Miss Honey and Gaga. Hey, it's me, Miss Honey. And today we're gonna learn all about shapes. Shapes, S-H-A-P-E-S. Shapes are like circles or squares or triangles or a rhombus or a cone or a star or a heart. There's so many fun shapes to learn about. Are you guys ready? Yes? Let's go. Shape, shapes, all the shapes I see. I see shapes in everything. I'll show you what I mean. I see a circle in a grape or heart-shaped leaf. I see a cone in a birthday hat or my Christmas tree. I see my door's rectangle and a cylinder cup for me. I see shapes in everything, in everything I see. A triangle looks like this. A triangle could also be a slice of pizza. Or this little bell is a triangle. Some flags are also triangle shaped. See the flag? Or there are some triangle shaped sails on boats. Triangle! This is a triangle. It has three sides. Let's count them together. One, two, three. This shape is a cone. It's like a triangle, except the bottom is round. Have you ever been driving in the car and you see an accident or maybe construction going on in the road and you see orange cones that look like this? Those are cone shapes. Or when you go to an ice cream shop and you get an ice cream on a cone, they call it a cone because it's cone shaped. This is my square. It has four sides. Let's count them together. One, two, three, four. A square looks like this. A box is a square. Or blocks you play with are sometimes squares. Let's stack them. Whoa! <laughs> square boxes. Have you ever seen a jack in the box? It's like a little box like this and usually you wind it up and it plays a song. Usually pop goes the weasel and then pop out comes Jack. You want to do the song? All around the mulberry bush the monkey chased the weasel. The monkey thought it was all in fun. Pop goes the weasel. <laughs> this is my rectangle. It has four sides. It's kind of like a square, but a little more wide. Since we're talking about things that are shaped like a rectangle, I thought I'd point out some that you might know. Money is shaped like a rectangle. Or a normal sheet of paper is rectangle shaped. Or if you have a little wagon that you might ride in, or a toy one that you put your dolls inside and carry along, it's shaped like a rectangle. Maybe your TV screen might be rectangle shaped. This is a rectangle drawing board, and I'm gonna draw a rectangle inside of a rectangle. <laughs> this is my rumbus. It has four sides. It's kind of like a square, but it's tilted to the side. This is a rhombus. It's kind of like a square, except it's tilted. It looks like this. Diamonds are the shape of a rhombus. Sometimes you find diamonds on playing cards. I love to play cards. Diamonds. Rhombus. <laughs> this is my circle. It has no sides and it goes round and round and round and round. Oh my! A ring is a circle. There's a really fun song and kind of activity that you can do with your friends or your stuffed animals. 
It's ring around the rosy. Ring around the rosy, pocket full of posy. Ashes, ashes, we all fall down. And then you fall on the ground. <laughs> Yay! This is my oval. It has no sides. It's kind of like a circle, but a little more wide. Hi, it's Gaga. My necklace is an oval. See, it's an oval. And you know what else is an oval? An egg. I have a poem about an egg. Humpty Dumpty sat on a wall. Humpty Dumpty had a great fall. And all the king's horses and all the king's men couldn't put Humpty together again. This is a cylinder. Pipes are cylinders or a can of potato chips comes in a cylinder can or a fire hydrant. There's so many cool things that are in the shape of a cylinder. Hi, it's Gaga. Here's a couple things that are cylinders. A paper towel roll is a cylinder. And you know when you go to a park and you go in a tunnel at the park? That's a cylinder. And here's another thing that's a cylinder. It's a candle. It is a cylinder. This is a heart shape. Aw, look, I can make a heart with my hands. Can you try? You see a lot of hearts and heart-shaped things around Valentine's Day. Or sometimes if someone's signing a card or a letter, they'll put a heart, like love, Miss Honey. This is my heart. It's like two candy canes. And boom, 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 is what my heart would say. Here's a little song about your heart. My heart loves your heart. I love you all the time. My heart loves your heart and your heart loves mine. My heart loves your heart. I love you all the time. My heart loves your heart and your heart loves mine. Yay! I love you. This is a hexagon. Have you ever been driving and you see this sign? It's a stop sign. That's a hexagon. Go, 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 stop. Go, 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 stop. <laughs> hexagon. Here's a couple things that have hexagons on them. The skin of a pineapple has hexagons all over it. And a honeycomb has hexagons inside. This is a hexagon. It has six sides. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hexagon. This is a star, a star shape. Sometimes you can see stars in the sky at night or a star in the top of your Christmas tree. Wow, so pretty. I love stars. That reminds me of a song. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Up above the world so high, like a diamond in the sky. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Yay! You ready to do counting all the way up to 10? This is my star and it has 10 sides. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10! And here's another shape. It's a cross. This reminds me of how much Jesus loves me. There's a little song about Jesus. Jesus loves me, this I know, for the Bible tells me so. Little ones to him belong. They are weak, but he is strong. Yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. 
The Bible tells me so. Shapes are all around us. Why don't you try and look around your house or wherever you go and notice all the different shapes, like even pillows. What shape is this? It's a square. Or this pillow, it's a rectangle. Let's spell the word shape. S H A P E S. Shapes. S H A P E S. Shapes. Okay, everyone, it's time for a pop quiz. Are you ready? Yes? Nod your head yes and say, yes, yes. Okay, let's go. What is this? What shape is it? Is it a triangle? Is it a square? Is it a circle? It's a square. Good job. How about this? Is it a circle? Is it a triangle? Is it a star? It's a star! Good job! Okay, one more. What shape is this? Is it a rectangle? Is it a heart? Is it a circle? It's a rectangle! Good job! Yay! <laughs> Yay! I had so much fun today learning about shapes with you. Did you have fun too? Yes? Well, it's about that time to end our show. So I want to close it with some little affirmations. You're strong, you're brave, you're smart, you're handsome or beautiful, and I love you very much. So wrap your arms around yourself and give yourself a big hug. Mm. And that's a hug from me to you. See you again next time. Bye.